When you're using Playwright for web scraping or browser automation, you may get blocked by Cloudflare and may not be able to get past this verification step. There's a solution to bypass Cloudflare, regardless of the programming language you're using with Playwright, by leveraging the no driver package. I'll be using Playwright with Java. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use a small script to export session cookies and local storage data directly into a format that you can then load up with Playwright. Let's jump right in. Even with tweaks to browser settings, Cloudflare may still recognize you as a bot and block your scripts. Here's an example of what this looks like on Indeed.com. Even if I manually click the verification checkbox to pass the login step when launching a Playwright browser, I'd still be blocked and stuck in a loop. To solve this, we're going to use a Python package called NoDriver, which by default mimics normal browser behavior to bypass bot detection. Let's simply launch the browser again with the no driver to navigate to indie.com. Here I'll click the checkbox and now you see that the website no longer detects the automated browser and allows us through. First, make sure to pip install no driver. Now let's take a look at the Python script that will help us capture the session data. First, we initiate a browser session, then we navigate to indeed.com. Here you need to log in manually one time to fetch the authenticated cookies. Next, we retrieve the cookies and local storage data. These no driver methods store cookies and local storage in a different format. So we'll just convert them into a JSON file compatible with our Playwright scripts. This data will then be saved into a JSON file. This is the key step. You will be able to copy this file and use it in your web scraping or automation workflows. So now I'll run the script and manually log in to Indeed to save the session data. This only needs to be done one time since all future automation flows will be reusing the authenticated cookies. After you log in, wait until the browser session is stopped and you'll then see the JSON file saved in the project folder. Now let's paste this file into the Playwright project folder. I'll now load the JSON file using this built-in Playwright method. If we launch the browser now and navigate to the same website, the Playwright browser shouldn't face any Cloudflare blocks and skip the login steps as well. There you go.